interesting trying to bargain with me? Well, you know what happens when pirates try to bargain with me. I tell them to go to hell. Hello everybody, Grace still plays, and we're back with more Halcyon 6 Starbase Commander. No time for BS, our powerful squadron led by a female-like Robocop, I really don't know, a cyborg Kano Mortal Kombat-like replica here, has got a bunch of pirate beating to do. There are red blips all over this radar, and I have a feeling that that is all bad guys. Now, one thing that I noticed is we can definitely click on all these and kind of take a look at who is kind of who makes up each of these squadrons and determine how difficult they might be. Now, here we are. I'm not 100% sure how much how much um, fuel we have, but we do have to take out a bunch of these guys. What do we have over here? Stationed at Leo. Now, I think that there was something going on at Leo. There's all kinds of stuff going on over here. Pirate fleet detected. Pirates are a nuisance in this sector. Neutralize this fleet to earn a reward. We also have to get more dark matter because we have to research a uh, cruel lab. And to do that, we need, I think about, we need 500 total. So what I want to do is probably get down here if we can get here and beat these guys up real quick. Oh boy, we got someone bombarding the fleet in a little bit. Commander, our raider fleet is bombarding the station. We should send a fleet to defeat them as soon as possible. Jesus! You can't, you can't get anywhere here. These guys are everywhere. Ooh, Corazon Tactician. Damage resistance versus Corazon. Very good. I love it. I don't think I've really messed with that many Corazonic people yet, but uh, whatever. So let's go ahead and take out this pirate band. It doesn't look like they have a lot here. There's basically one ship that maybe has some firepower and two little pew pewers. Start the combat. What do we have here? A spray and prayer, a warden mark one. He does have an incarceration beam. We can probably just get these guys right out quick though. Let's finish these guys up and we'll take the warden out last. Let's see what our uploading virus does. Ah, we got two of them. Two out of three ain't bad. Over here with the into the fray, the way I like to start off my combat. The vulnerability does get exploited and everyone gets a heavy buff of 25% to their damage and aim. Now, he's almost already destroyed, so I think we can probably go ahead here and just flak barrage him, and that should probably finish him off. Excellent. That is just what I wanted to do. So before the, even the first round of combat goes by, we're up one person. Ooh, here's the beam. Let's see what it does. Now, we, we resisted. Excellent. The Acolyte manages to resist. I am so happy to see that. And now, let's go ahead and try this Dark Matter Extraction. I think it'll get some healing in while we kind of play. Or, I don't know, maybe it gets us Dark Matter. That would be great, too. From here, I believe this guy is now vulnerable. He is. This does exploit vulnerable, so let's go ahead and use our teleport charges here. Excellent. 57 damage, and he also has to deal with 108 damage over the next couple of rounds. From here, hmm, we have a deconstruct, which we can probably use with a portal cannon if this doesn't kill him in one shot. It does not. And he resists it. Damn. How do you like that? A couple of spray and prays hitting our night ship, but luckily the night is made to take a beating. Let's go ahead and get our health as high as possible by throwing down a nano restoration field. We want to keep our materials up and we don't want to have to spend that much to heal. All right, Margaret, you know what to do. Crippling shot. Actually, you know what? Harass that guy. Finish him off. I don't want this person on the map any longer. Turn him to space dust. Excellent. Peace is flying everywhere. The cries of our foes echoing through the cosmos. From here we have... I'm going to go ahead and try a deconstruct again. I would like to see the hull get breached. Ah, it does get breached. That is fantastic, and that means that he's going to be taking damage, and he's going to take extra from this portal cannon. I'm hoping to see a good 200 damage there. Bam! 207 damage looks fantastic. Let's go ahead and take those engines down, because we might as well. And then we can follow up with some big hits. Another portal cannon here. This Acolyte's actually pretty darn fast. And from here, the Flak Barrage should almost take this guy to the ground. 143 damage, that is definitely not too shabby. Man, this guy is super slow, and we're going to take advantage of that big time. Let's continue to get those engines down so we can chain off it if need be. And that may be the last hit. Yes, pirates are wiped out, and we have won yet another battle and taken no damage. In fact, we healed ourselves. Oh, that's so good. Pirate fleet de detected. 
And we got it. Okay, so we get an additional 50 rewarded. Ooh, I've been promoted. Uh, I've been promoted. I can advance my training now. What would you like me to focus on? Well, let's take a look at what you have. We can get the backstab maneuver. Oh, man. Into the fray. Damage percent. 50 percent? You gotta be kidding me. That's incredible. I mean, is that the percent? Is that the percent of her damage? Or is that the percent that she's going to inspire everyone by? It doesn't really say. This backstab maneuver is kind of nice, too, though. Because it's 125% damage and it disables a ship. I do kind of like being able to lock stuff down. This is actually kind of tough. I think I'm going to go ahead and select the backstab maneuver because being able to lock a ship down is really good. Let's go ahead and return back to base because we have to deal with this BS now. And it looks like a cruel vanguard of all types of different things are there. Distress signal, star system, stratonic... Oh my god. Straton Ixia. Uh, show the location. Where's that? And of course, all the way at the other side of the nebula. Fantastic. Let's keep moving on. We got to get this guy out of our base. Now, can we even send a fleet there? Okay, it doesn't actually cost anything. We're dealing with a mastermind, a vanguard, or an aberrant, and a spike. This shouldn't be too bad. Put everyone together here. We've got quite a few stars on our ships these days. They're looking pretty tough, these ladies. Let's go ahead and launch the fleet. And whip up on these guys. Ah, Collective Destroyer damage bonus versus the Collective. Now, we haven't seen a lot of these different people yet. I know we saw this Collective race for only a couple seconds when they talked to us while we were busy. And they were just like, hey, just letting you know we're here. Well, thanks, buddy. So, let's see what we have. We have one straight damager. We have an Aberrant, which I'm pretty sure is the healer. Uh, it definitely is. And then we have this thing. What the hell is this? Ah, it's just a spike guy. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Let's upload the virus real quick. We're going to be focusing on this aberrant and try and get this guy off. Oh, sensors offline all around. And we resisted. That is so good. Let's go ahead and inspire the fleet. Ah, the fleet is inspired and 156 points of damage echoes across the entirety of our group. Oh, we're taking a couple of beats, but that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and shock this guy down to size. Really resisted, you son of a bitch. Wow, that was actually pretty tough from that Chaos Cannon. Hmm. From here, um, do I feel like Nano Restoration Fielding? Actually, go ahead. This is a healer. Why not go ahead and start healing? From here, I'm hoping to see some decent damage from our other two ships right here. Now, we can go ahead and take these engines down, so hopefully we will be able to chain off of this. Yes, the engines are down. Fantastic. All right, we took a little bit of a hit, but it's not really quite, honestly, that bad. That is some good damage. 180 points, and it's just what I wanted to see. We're, we're taking a hull breach there. Not, not so good. Uh, we could siphon dark matter, but I think we're just going to go ahead and portal cannon for maximum damage here. Maximum straight damage, that is. Okay, we're definitely going to need to fix that hull in a little bit. Let us bring the engines down. That's what we'll do. We'll chain and then we'll heal. And I'm hoping to get this guy almost down to the ground. Now, we also have this repair overdrive. We could use that if we need to. But for right now, let's make sure... Oh, we forgot to get the engines down. I guess he resisted it. I didn't even see that. Let's go ahead and cauterize this hull and get them back up to speed. This should heal pretty much almost all the way. That was a great heal. Holy crap. And we got the, the extra heal on top of that. Ship disable for the backstab. Let's give the backstab a try. Let's see if we can disable this thing. I would really like to see this ship go down. Resisted, really, 187 damage though. Even without the dis disability, that damage is pretty darn good, 187 points. All right, guys, let's take this healer out once and for all. Let's not siphon dark matter. I don't think he's gonna be around long enough to even enjoy that, and that should do it. Yes, excellent, the aberrant is down. Let's take this spike to the ground because I think he's probably the next simplest ship to destroy. And then we'll only have to deal with the last one. From here, what do I feel like doing? We could do this and I think that's what we're gonna do. We could get two good instances here. All right, vulnerable, that's not too shabby. I'll go ahead and take vulnerable. Let's go ahead and upload the virus while we're at it. We got the sensors offline for both and usually I see some good results with that, but not there. Now, we're dealing with sensors offline and vulnerable. So let's see if we have anything here that can work off of that. We really don't, but you know what? Let's go ahead and drone overdrive us 
to heal up a little bit. I do want us at our best capacity. Excellent. Let's do this. That's what I like to see. Looks like the repair overdrive is still repairing. Oh, that's neat. Go ahead and bring the engines down while we're at it over here. That'll do some decent damage. Dang it, resisted. You gotta be kidding me. Let's try the portal cannon. Let's bring this guy down with a nice shot from the portal cannon. And we did 112 points of damage. Way to go, Katrina. Katrina, big MVP here with her healing skills and also her ability to deal some decent damage. Into the fray with one guy left. You're darn right we're going into the fray with a big vulnerability exploit as well. From there, we should be able to really get some decent damage on this guy. Let's go ahead and knock him out of the fight if we can. Resist it. Damn it. Well, we tried. Let's siphon the dark matter because now is the time. I'm still not 100% sure what the dark matter does besides dealing damage over time and creating vulnerable. And it looks like that's it, but that's fine. Creating vulnerable, let's sabotage it as well. That's going to be, be two different DOTs or damage over times for those of you who didn't play a ton of... MMOs in your time on this critter and why not let's go ahead and hull breach this thing too man He is gonna be taking a ton of damage each round and for the portal cannon to follow up. Oh, yeah 233 points of damage What else do we have here that we could use we could teleport explosives which would work, but we're already working on that The sensors are not offline I don't think so we really can't use this and our backstab is not prepared yet Let's go ahead and I guess we'll teleport the explosives. It will work off the vulnerability and it'll refresh the damage over time effect. From here, sabotaged and vulnerable. I don't think that we have anything that works off of that. We really don't. Let's see if we can breach the hull though. And the hull is breached, which means the portal cannon is going to do fantastic with 311 points of damage. That's what you get for trying to attack the Halcyon. Next time, maybe you'll know better. All right, guys, we are looking pretty darn good. We should have enough energy now to go ahead and start our research, which we really want to do. Let's go and start the cruel lab. Now, the lab is going to take a couple of days to probably get done, which means that we're also going to have... What happens if you go to, to the officer's quarters? I'm just kind of curious what you can see here. Oh, this is neat. Okay, it just kind of tells you some, some ground stats and such. Now, we're probably going to have to open up some space. Oh, we can actually build here. We don't need to open up some space. We have an open space in order to build that cruel lab, and I'm really happy to see that. We probably don't have any new ships that we can make. No. We do have to get some dark matter, though, for sure. Now, we have at least a few more problems going on. I remember seeing a distress signal. Actually, there's a whole bunch of distress signals. Man, there's distress signals everywhere. What is this? We have a couple of pirates and that's it? Yeah, this really doesn't look too bad at all. We can probably beat up on these guys pretty darn good. Let's go ahead and grab some fuel real quick. Because we want to refill up on fuel. There we go. Go ahead and grab this. 17 fuel. And I guess let's go ahead and start taking out these pirates. We'll get this started and finish these guys off and complete our control of this sector. I would also like to hope that maybe there's an extra depot with some more matter or materials for us. Science vessels. I know all about them. The navigator. What does the navigator do? An energy field and a spray and pray and just this little guy. So we are not dealing with very much at all. Let's go ahead and do some virus uploading. You know how I like to start things off. Sensors offline for both. That is awesome. Ooh, what is this? Well, that was some actually pretty decent damage. Into the fray is where we're going. And we exploit the damage and almost take that guy out immediately. Excellent. From here, I would say one more hit and this guy, this guy should be down. Let's go ahead and use a flak barrage because I don't want to use my harpoon and have that refreshing. I would rather use my harpoon on this navigator. Awesome. That's what I'm talking about. Put down the nano restoration field on our heroes so that everyone is fresh and raring to go for the next round. This got passed? You can pass combat? What does that even mean? I didn't think you could do that. What do we have here? Let's go ahead and bring this guy's engines down. We might as well. I don't like the way that they're staring at me. Yes, from here, we're going straight into the flak barrage for big damage. And from there, we can siphon matter if we want. And I think we're going to go ahead and do that to get vulnerable on the, on the map. Do we get it? Yes, we do. He's being drained and the dark matter extraction is there. Oh, actually, we don't. He resisted it. His sensors are still offline, though. Hmm. 
Interesting. Let's go ahead and harass. That'll exploit this and probably finish it off in one shot. Awesome. We are almost fully healed, and we took that pirate down to the ground, baby. Yeah. We have a whole bunch more pirates. Federation officers. This is Savic. I lead the Shriekers. Oh, this is one of those guys, the Collectors. You have just now destroyed my secondary fleet. I am impressed. Moreover, I may be of service to you. My location is visible to you. Come listen to my proposal. You and I, together, can stop this madness. Really? More pirates, huh? Interesting. Trying to bargain with me? Well, you know what happens when pirates try to bargain with me. I tell them to go to hell. But I guess let's go over to this... Well, hold on. Let's see if we can go over to this planet first. Can we even go to this planet? Ah, we can't because we have to deal with pirates. Well, very well. Three spray and prayers, huh? Things aren't going to look too good for you in just a minute. Let us start. Do we even care about uploading this virus? Actually, you know what? Yes, I do like uploading the virus. I love the graphic, too. This game has some really neat graphics and spaces. What? Only one of them on a spray and prayer? What a bunch of BS. I can't believe that. Oh, actually, I should have done this guy up here because his sensors are offline. But that's all right. We are fully buffed up. And from here, uh, let's see. Do we have anything that utilizes the sensors offline? Not really. Let's go ahead and just, I guess, flak barrage it. We may be able to take this guy out in one hit. Oh, yeah. The flak barrage worked fantastically. Sensors are still offline on number two here. And that is a good thing. Yes. Nice evasion. I like to see it. Let's go ahead and nano field so that we can get everyone as high as possible for the upcoming beatdowns. Because quite frankly, as I said, I don't deal with pirates. Sensors offline. And we have it. Harass. Fantastic. Take that guy to the ground. 320 points of damage. One hit kill, guys. We're actually getting pretty darn tough these days. We could lock this guy down, but it's almost like why? Why not just deconstruct him, breach his hull, and then follow up with a portal cannon? All right. He got a hit off. Not too bad. This portal cannon should bring him almost completely to the ground. Yep. 174 damage. He's gone. That leaves just one more group. Good, you came. I was greatly pleased with the news of Willa's demise. I have a proposal. I will provide you with the Admirax's base coordinates in addition to resources that will prove valuable to your survival. In exchange, all you must do is destroy the Admirax, which your current goal is regardless. Do we have an understanding, Terran? No, we don't. Didn't I just tell you about what happens when pirates try to deal with me? They get obliterated. And built on flawed logic? Really? Built on flawed logic, am I? Oh, you'll be dealing with my flawed logic in just a minute. What do we have here? A navigator? Now, what is this? Spray and pray and aggravated assault. So really nothing that I'm super worried about unless these guys are big heavy hitters. Let's go ahead and try and take everyone's sensors offline. Well, the two big ones that I cared about did go offline, so that's damn good. I kind of want to take advantage of this, but realistically, let's just this get this guy off of the lineup right away. That was a decent hit. Everyone's inspired. Now, I'm hoping we'll be able to get this guy out of here with one flak barrage. Let's see if one flak barrage will do it. Oh, almost down. You got to be kidding me. That was so close, guys. Portal cannon to the rescue. This should pretty much do it. Well, there goes part of your fleet, Slavic. Or Savic, whatever your name is. I won't need to know your name pretty soon because you'll just be a memory. What other sort of things do we happen to have here? Crippling shot, harass. We can bring the engines down, which is good. This guy's sensors are offline. Let's go and exploit that as best we can because there's no reason not to. Oh, 266 points of damage. Oh, yeah. Let us repair with the overdrive, and I'll probably do another heal on this person. I shouldn't say this person. I should say Miss Freehold because I know who she is. To get her back up to full health, a nice cauterized hull should put her ship back into fully able duty. Yes, pathetic and an evasion. Now it's time. Now it's our turn to bring the pain. Sensor's offline. We could harass him for a vulnerability, and I think I will. Let's go ahead and take advantage of the vulnerability. 341 damage, guys. That's kind of why I did that. That's a lot of damage, and that's going to help us later on. Let's see if we can lock this ship down. Yes, the ship is locked down. That is fantastic. And from there, I guess we can go ahead and Dark Matter Siphon to get the vulnerability trait on him as long as it doesn't resist. And he does not. Nice. From there, let's see if we have something that exploits vulnerable. We do. It's going to be this teleport explosives. 
and probably our DOTs will probably kill this guy before he even gets a chance to go. With that in mind, let's start with the portal cannon on the Navigator Mark II. Yes, big damage there. Let us continue with a Salvage Harpoon because I think we can put some big weaknesses on and we did, vulnerable and sensors offline. Oh, we're gonna harass this guy for big damage. Right to the ground, no chance of survival. And how about you? How are you doing, buddy? I know your turn's coming up. Oh, your hull was breached. You're in a million pieces. Sorry about that. Just kidding. So from there, the battle is won. We've defeated the pirate fleet again, and we got another 200 dark matter from that. Nice. We're cleaning up the pirates, guys. I hope you're enjoying Halcyon 6. Man, I love this game so much, and I plan to continue bringing it to you. Let's go ahead and look at this real fast though while we're oh that is not what i wanted to do at all in fact we'll just kind of pause we'll just kind of pause in mid space here actually can i send no i can't we'll pause in mid space here and i will tell you guys to join me next time until then stay foxy and much love